Hello. Hey, Vito. It's Eddie. Hey, Eddie. What's up? I need you to come over to Joe's right now. <sighs> yeah. Oh, okay. All right. What's happening? I, I can't tell you. All right. I'll be right there. I went on with a baseball bat, and they looked like they were scared till Boy, yesterday. Fellas. Oh, hey, good morning, Vito. Marty, what are you doing here? Joe said you need help. And since I did good with the greases, he said he'd take me along again. Take you along again for what, exactly? They're waiting for you. Yeah, well, uh, uh, see you later. Uh, yeah, that's my man, Vito. <laughs> morning, Mr. Fowler. Hiya, Vito. Take a seat. Hey, guys. <clears throat> so what's happening? I heard how you got rid of Luca, Vito. Good job. Thanks to you, we now have proof that Clemente was behind the attack on our guys. We couldn't have him openly till now. He just cut his own throat. He kidnapped and tortured our guys, and that means war. Everything we do now, I'm going to be able to justify before the commission. Alberto knows this. So he can act quickly and try and come after us first. So we're going to take out Clemente. Exactly. Turns out Clemente called a big meeting in the Empire Arms Hotel today. It's his best chance to get rid of him and his top guys. Oh, sure, yeah. We'll just waltz right in there and kill a few dozen heavily armed men. But daylight in the nicest hotel in town. Is that about right? Don't worry. 
I got a plan. Shit! Joe, put that thing away. Hey, don't worry, it's safe. I just gotta For press Christ's sake, put it away now. Okay, What's the with you? okay. You're such a chicken shit. Okay, okay, so now we're gonna waltz right in and blow up the nicest hotel in town. Isn't that overkill? Don't worry, this thing ain't that powerful. It won't blow up the whole building, but everybody in the room where it goes off is dead meat. How are we gonna know when to detonate it? We'll use a window washing platform. We'll almost be able to watch it explode. Since when are you the smart one? Okay, fellas. If all goes well, I'll have something nice for you. When it's over, call Eddie at this number. Oh, by the way, I closed the bar today, just in case Alberto tried something. Hey, good luck, fellas. Hey, what about that kid in the hallway? You mean Marty? Uh, he ain't part of the organization, so he had to wait outside. I mean, why is he here at all? What do you think? He's going with us because we need a getaway driver and somebody to cover our asses. What do you got against him anyway? I known him since he was a little kid, and he saved my ass with them breeches. Yeah, but we're not fighting a bunch of drunk dirtbags this time. We're about to take out the most powerful family in this city, and you're bringing a kid. How old were you when you started doing this shit? You're talking like you're some old fart. Look, Vito, he's gonna wait in the car outside and drive us away. That's it. He ain't even gonna know what we're doing there. He's a great driver, and that's exactly what we need on this one. Okay, Joe, whatever. But I'm telling you right now, this is a bad idea. What kind of job is it? The kind you don't need to know about. The gabiche. Oh, okay. But hey, if you need it, I got my piece right here. All right, slow down, Billy the Kid, all right? It's not going to be necessary. Let's just go. Don't go bust that up here. I'm pretty sure that explosives and car crash don't go. You know, I'm just curious, you know? All the secrets. All the secrecy is important. Let's you know what we're all for. And if you keep asking questions, I'm just going to have somebody else to drive us. Here's the hotel. The garage is on the other side. Park in there. And hey, we gotta leave all our guns in the car. The last thing we need is one of Clement's goons 
open up some fine. All right, Vito and me will go in and do what needs to be done. You wait for us here. When you hear a big boom, start the car up. You're going to need to get the hell out of here. Pronto. And you won't need that gun unless somebody follows us. But that shouldn't happen. Okay, okay, I got you, Joe. Clemente rented the entire 18th floor, the third one from the top. There's a couple of suites and conference rooms up there, and guards. Round the back to the laundry room. What, you want to wash your shorts before we do this? Wise ass. The meeting hasn't started yet. We'll grab some hotel worker uniforms, then we'll go do a little cleaning upstairs. Seriously? When did you become the smart one? Fuck off. There's supposed to be a guy inside with the uniforms. Let's go. And we don't want to make a ruckus before Clemente gets here, so don't go doing nothing stupid. Huh. Shouldn't I be telling you that? Stay here. Ah, where's the fucking bridesmaid? Ah, shit, it's close. The idiot was supposed to leave it all before us. Now we gotta wait and hope that asshole shows up. Fuck. Hey, you see uh, now? Can I help you, sir? Where is he? He go on small break. I'm really sorry I couldn't get here sooner. Another minute, you would be late to your own damn funeral. Sorry, I was. Right, enough. Just get the hell out of here. See? I got it all under control. Come on, let's go pick up our uniforms. Vito, one more thing. Here, put this on. Are you fucking serious? Nobody recognizes us. Just put it on. Great. Let's go. Hey, you two. Clean up this fucking mess. You that shit here is a what? Out here, I said. Clean this shit up, will you? Slip and break their neck. Oh, it. Hey, you two. You got some more work upstairs waiting for you. Get moving. Hey, Richie, come with us. Was fucking Henry. Yeah. All right, come on. Let's get up there before he gets back. I haven't seen Henry in a while. Hasn't changed a bit. <laughs> yeah. I hope he don't come back before we do our thing. Henry's good people, even if he does work for Clemente. Yeah, but what if he does? Don't even think about that. I feel like I need to think on my lip. Yeah? Well, what if we run into somebody we know? This way, they won't recognize us. I fucking hope so. About damn time. Where the hell you guys been? Somebody spilled something in the conference room. You ain't gonna... a big meeting starting soon. The boss ain't gonna be too happy if the place ain't sparkling by then. Well, if you know what's good for you, get the place spick and span and then get the fuck out of there. Uh, Was that a yes? Uh, please go away. These two are here to clean up the, uh, mess. The mess? 
shit cleaned up and you gotta make it snappy. Tricks. Hey, calm down. Yeah. Then I'll come around. Hey, hey, yeah. Give me a hand here. Okay, the hard part is almost over. <clears throat> Stop there fishing it and let's go. Stop there fishing it and let's go. Looks like you're done. All right, you can get out of here. Okay, let's get to the roof. That's Clemente. I'm out right now. If we had a gun. Man, we two seconds. Just take it easy and stick to the plan. Exercise. Why did I gotta put so many fucking stairs? Vito, Vito, hold on. I forgot something. Yeah, this is for you. Just in case something goes wrong. This is nice. Some piece of work, eh? 1911 coal with a modified the clip. Hell did you, uh... Holds 23 bullets, so the ammo goes quick. And don't go losing it. These are the only two in the whole world. Thanks. Never mind. We gotta go to the window washing platform. Come on. Yeah, come down and give me a fucking smack. Yeah, these guys. Fuck me. Yeah. All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> oh, this is like an oyster. Hold on, hold on, check it out.